What's up, everybody? It's your favorite Barry, host Mo Barry, and welcome back to this channel. Uh, listen, as you can see, no mask again. <laughs> I need to buy more masks, so bear with me. I'm gonna get me some more masks. But I just kind of wanted to talk about what's going on right now in our world. Uh, what are your thoughts? Um, maybe this is my venting session, um, girl without the mask. But I just want to know, like, what's your thoughts or feelings going on during this time of unrest. There's a lot of unrest. There's a lot of um, uneasiness happening in the world today. And many people are just really concerned, worried, uh, and they don't quite know what to do or who to look for, you know, when it comes to getting answers. So depending on your faith, and I know, you know, depending on what channel you watch, you could come on here and it could get kind of controversial because maybe someone here is not looking to hear about someone's faith, but I can guarantee you guys that is what is keeping me so excited and keeping me so strong during these uncertain times, during these times of unrest. Um, I've been seeking God's face so much during this time of isolation and I'm so grateful for it because it's just showing me that God's word is so real. These times that we're living in are so real and guess what? It's only going to get worse. Wickedness is only going to increase. The hearts of men will grow cold, you know, but God tells us to look for these signs, you know, because our, our redemption, it draws near. So whether or not you believe, I encourage you to believe. Anyone who stumbles across this video, I encourage you to believe. I encourage you to learn and understand Jesus Christ for who he is and what he did for you and the gift that God gave to mankind so that we can be saved and have eternal life in paradise and one day enter into the kingdom of God. It's serious, y'all. It's serious. And, you know, the reason why it's serious is because they tell us to look for this new normal. But guess what? The UN on their website, they already have that the new world order is, is, is here. It hasn't been declared, but it's on their website underneath their, their name. Go to the UN.org, I think it is. Uh, look at the, the streets, the world. Everyone's just going crazy, rioting, you know. But... The Bible tells us this is what's going to happen. It's going to happen. It's going to increase. And really, there's nothing we can do about it except continue to seek God's face, continue to want to obey. And guess what obeying means? Obeying means doing the will of God. And guess what the will of God is? The will of God is simple. It's just for us to believe that he sent his son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross for our sins. That's what it is, y'all. And I have to be bold now. I can't be afraid to be mocked or made fun of because time is so short. They already told us in 2018, time is up. That slogan, yeah, subliminal, time is up. They've been told us that. And it was the start of this whole shutting down the whole world. We, we, we witnessed something as in the days of Noah before God told Noah to board, build that ark, board that ark. And guess what happened? All of mankind was destroyed. So, so as in the days of Noah, as in the days of Noah, so will be the son of God. I believe that's what that scripture is. But it's just to tell us that time is, is running out. Mankind will soon be destroyed. Uh, and you want to be a part of the kingdom. You want to be a part of the church because y'all, I can guarantee you that rapture is coming soon. And don't let them fool you and tell you it was the aliens that took us because it wasn't. All right. So I'm going to keep it real. Uh, but that's a whole other topic. I know it's like crazy. Woo, woo, woo. There's so many different points to this whole thing. There's so many different, there's levels to this, you know, there's so much to it, but God is so good, and I just wanted to come on here for anyone who just stumbles across my video. I just wanted to say, stay encouraged, and Jesus is the answer. And if you seek him, and you get to know him, and everything that's about to happen, it's going to excite you. It's actually going to excite you. And I think I will touch on some of the points about why the rapture is so near, and I should probably do it this week. But just stay encouraged. I love you guys, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.